What is Thanos? Thanos is a Greek masculine given name, a short form of Athanasios, the masculine form of the word Athanasia. That's Greek for immortality. It's called Infinity War because it's the war against immortality. The Avengers represent mortality. Thanos represents immortality. Thanos, the knower, the one that knows. Thanos knew how to bring balance to the universe because he's the all-knowing. He said to Gamora, little one, it's a simple calculus. The universe is finite. Its resources finite. If life is left unchecked, life will cease to exist. It needs correction. She says to him, you don't know that. Thanos says, I'm the only one who knows that. <laughs> At least, I'm the only one with the will to act on it. <laughs> Think about that. The name Thanos also has an occult meaning. Thanos is a compound word. The and nos. The, T-H-A, is the, T-H-E. The means God. The is the root word in theology, the study of the. God means to invoke, call upon, or to pour. Nos means mind. When you think of the mind, you think of the head. The mind is the dome. The dome is where dominion takes place. Thanos means mind of God, God mind, or God head, the king dome. The king dome is where the king has dominion. The king is represented by the crown. Thanos wears the power gauntlet. The power gauntlet represents the hand of God. The hand of God possesses the power of God's will. Thanos also means to invoke the mind, call upon the mind, and to pour from the mind. You invoke thought from the mind. You call upon the mind for knowledge, and wisdom pours from the mind. This is divine libation. Now, notice in Infinity War, Thanos obtains the time stone from Doctor Strange after defeating him on a planet called Nowhere. Nowhere is now here, the now. The mind represents space. There is no time in space, meaning the mind isn't bound by time. There is no past, no future. There is only the present. The present is the now. Thanos obtaining all of the infinity stones and bringing peace to a grateful universe symbolizes mastering the mind with internal balance. Mastering the mind with internal balance. The sun shining is the soul's light. The grateful universe is the mind at ease. Thanos letting go of Gomorrah to obtain the soul stone represents detachment from the physical world and the love for the physical world. The story of Thanos is the, the story of Thanos is the story of ascension. He wouldn't let his love for the physical stand in the way of his destiny. He was willing and able to let go of his physical pleasures and desires. That's mastery of the root and sacral chakra. The root chakra is the lowest self. The sacral chakra is the gut feeling urging to be greater and to elevate to the solar, our soul. Our soul system that receives light from the soul. The truth is the light. The light that shines from the soul. The glow that radiates from the inner to the outer. The truth, the way, the light. The ability to receive truth and speak truth. The heart chakra feels truth. The throat chakra speaks truth. The brow chakra sees truth, and the crown chakra knows truth, divine truth, truth beyond emotion. Our chakras house our emotions. Mastering chakras is mastering your emotions.
Thanos came down from the throne to execute his will. The all knowing. The all knows truth. Because it's seen truth. Because it's seen truth. It speaks truth. And it speaks truth because it feels truth. Ignorance is where truth gets lost. Humanity is ignorance. Thanos fought against humanity to restore truth. He was successful because he is the manifestation of superior will. Superior will is the Lord's will. Will. The will of the Lord. <laughs> the Lord's will. <laughs> Lord means superior. The crown represents superiority. That's why the crown sits on the king's dome. Mm. The crown symbolizes the king's dominion. If you notice in the other Avengers movies, when they show Thanos, he's sitting on the throne, giving orders from the throne. The war between Thanos and the Avengers symbolizes the war within, the war against self, higher self and lower self. This movie focuses on Thanos' quest to obtain all six infinity stones. Six is the number for equality. Equality brings balance. Merging the lower self with the higher self is equality. Equality creating balance. Thanos and his loyal black order were required to travel all over the galaxy in search of the stones. Thanos also represents self-mastery. The gauntlet and stones also represent the seven chakras. The galaxy represents the houses of the chakras, the inner body, where the divine energies dwell. The loyal black order are the energies that are loyal to the ascension of the soul, the rise of the titan, the celestial being, the true self. The war for infinity is the war for immortality, humanity versus inhumanity.